we'd normally be on the job by 8 o'clock. We wouldn't get home until 6 o'clock. Good, hard, long day. And you'd feel the better for it. I finished my leaving cert in 2001 and I went straight into my apprenticeship, a four-year apprenticeship, which I served in Cork with the family business. Um, with 40 weeks of it in block release in the Cork Institute of Technology and FOSS in Bishopstown. One of the best aspects of painting is that you're never in the same place for too long. You're constantly moving, you're seeing different sites, different types of jobs, different work, different buildings, and totally transforming them from what they were to what you're making them into. Basically, we're just starting this job now. Um, there's a, I think it's been about 15 years since the last time was painted. Probably have four men here for for four week duration, we'll, t we'll take out all the seats, the, the floor in it will all be re as well. The statues will all be repainted, everything will be done from top to bottom. I took over the father's business in 2008, the worst possible time. We had a staff of eight men which was cut back to two men, but already it's starting to grow again, we're back, we have four men again and we can see further prospects of taking on more staff in, in the very near future. There's a lot more to it than people realise. Uh, there's always a, a problem that you haven't encountered. Um, there can be different substrates and different problems with dampness and alkali problems and things like that that need specialist knowledge to, to, to treat properly and to, to cure the problem before painting it. You need to be hardworking, determined, not afraid of heights. <laughs> it's what I love and it's what I know, so it's what I'll be sticking to.